Hey friends, you're working on drawing conclusions today. So I just thought I'd give you a quick little um, lesson on how to do that. You can always look at the title. This is called Just Like My Brother. So I can infer that the giraffe in this picture wants to be just like his brother. I can also infer that that is his brother. Normally you just look at the picture and think that was his mom or his dad. But since the title is Just Like My Brother, I can infer that that's his brother. So I can draw that conclusion. Looking throughout the book, this says, hmm, I'll ask the elephants. They know everything. So from that page, I can infer that elephants are smart. If they know everything, they must be smart. Okay, at least in this book they are. Um, you can do this with all your books. You can always look at the title. Chester Raccoon and the Big Bad Bully. Read the title and infer, draw conclusions about what's going on. Uh, I can conclude that Chester, the raccoon, might be having a problem with a big bad bully. Okay? If, it, if he says big bad bully, sounds to me like a problem, right? So I can... Read this title, and I can draw conclusions that this would be a good book to learn about problem solving, problem and solution, because there's a problem. If, if there's a bully, that's a problem. If they're big and bad, that's a problem. I can open up the book and go to any page and draw conclusions. It says, they huddled close to one another and walked toward the bully in one great, big, confident path with Chester in front holding a ball. I can conclude that being a team, they're synergizing, working together. I can conclude that they feel more confident because they are together. If you had a problem with a bully, would you want to face them alone? Wouldn't it make you feel more confident? So the words say... They huddled close to one another and walked toward the bully in one great, big, confident pack with Chester in front holding a ball. I think the ball is his weapon, just in case. But it says they huddled close together. They still may have some fear, but pulling together, synergizing, they're feeling more confident. So just use your skills today when you're drawing conclusions. Make sure you look at that title really closely. See how it can help you. Look at the pictures, look at the words. Read and reread. Good readers reread, they back up and reread. If it didn't make sense, if you didn't process it the first time, you might need to back up and reread. Reorganize your thoughts. Listen to how it sounds as it comes out. You may not have read it exactly right. Or if you did, you may not have understood it and just needed a second chance, okay? Enjoy drawing conclusions today. I know you're going to be great at it.